Oh my God, I've just had the craziest dream. We were driving in space in our motorhome. Ah, how scary is that? What a bad dream. Am I awake? Am I dreaming? And we were losing, we were losing power and heading back towards Earth. It was so scary. Oh my God, imagine we just lost power. But we haven't lost power. Power has arrived. Thanks to two, Susie at Total Call. Cool. She's our savior. It's a the bad dream, it's not a bad dream. Oh my god. Yeah, so it wasn't actually uh, a bad dream after all. Uh, the, the reality is we've actually had delivered today one of these Total Cool Total Power 500. It's a um, 500 watt portable lithium ion inverter power bank. So um, yeah, thank you very much to Susie for sending us this from Total Cool. And I'll tag in her um, details to contact her again as previously, uh, which I showed on the uh, the freezer, the fridge freezer box that we've just um, got off Susie as well. So if anybody wants any of these sort of products, you can contact Susie and um, she will um, give you a really good discount if you just quote Mo Hotel Adventures, uh, quote us and uh, basically she will do her very best to give you the best prices on these products and she's doing them from some really realistic prices uh, so it's really worth, um, you know, if you're after this kind of um, device and loads of people are at the moment, it's one of them, those things so basically if you're um, thinking about doing a van conversion and don't want to go to all the cost of uh, putting in um, leisure batteries and stuff like that just maybe to run a few small electrical items we're actually hoping that this machine is going to um, sort our like uh, fridge freezer box out uh, occasionally we're thinking you know if we kind of like uh, pull in for a bit of time and we don't want to sort of like leave it ripping the, t the 12 volt out of the um, the van we can put this on and uh, obviously a lot of other um, uses as well obviously it's got a uh, a phone charger I don't know what because my phone's got a case on it so but they um, so I don't know whether it's gonna work until I find out uh, get me phone out and get it all kitted up but there is a rechargeable pad on the top for um, phones I'll get it out of the box in a minute and um, yeah, got two year warranty on this product. Look, it's got um, all the bits and pieces that you're going to need. It's got your USBs. It's got that smaller um, USB socket plug on it and two 240 outlets and as well as a cigarette lighter. And yeah, it looks pretty good. We were, um, she was showing us this item and we're kind of like, yeah, that looks pretty darn good. And yeah, I'm just going to pull it out of the box now. Yeah, basically, just before I pull it out of the box, there there we go. Look. It's actually running a Total Cool fridge freezer box there. That's very similar to the one we've got. Well, it's exactly the same as the one we've got. Ours is the slightly bigger one, I think. Um, it's also running the air cooler Total Cool Do as well, which is very popular. And obviously, yeah, that'll match with that. Look. So, yeah, excellent. There's the little, it's got two little carrying handles that fold down nice and flat to keep the device nice and square when it's situated. There's there's an actual picture of the phone sat on it. Um, this unit is 6.5 kilos, and so the battery capacity is 500 watts there. I'll um, probably tag in some of this information because I'm not into too much... Uh, information you you know the score it's um dimensions your outlets usb uh your dc outputs and charging it gives you the ac charging rates there what it's going to do and again we're a lot of the time we're kind of on like electric hookups and stuff so um yeah okay you know we're kind of thinking yeah as soon as you get on electricity bang it on and uh you know we do long drives so even on the the um car charger you know it's it's i think from 
totally empty to to totally full it's like 10 11 hours but hey you know if it's in the back of your motorhome uh, while you're driving and um you know like i say we're going to probably leave home with it fully charged every opportunity you get you're going to bang it on the electric and uh, give you loads of extra all your bits and pieces there that come in the kit yeah it's ripping the box open now so we've got our little user guide on top there so we won't read that. No, we will. We'll have a look. I'll get my wife to read that. I'm too excited. Oh, this is the bot. This must be all the uh, charging cables and stuff in this one. Look at that. All the kit again. Very similar. Oh, no. Slightly different to the fridge adapter. Oh, there's it. Is that? Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah. Little. Uh, all your bits and bobs in there some more bits and bobs in this box in the middle there's the um, usual cables the uh, for your um, euro socket and the 240 so that goes with that there's our um, that's the connection I think for the this is going to be the connection for the solars so you can add on the solar panels for recharging it if you want to um, so there's your 240 and uh, yeah our, what the hell my god just Joff wake up man this is the 12 volt the 12 volt plug so all the, all, the, all the plugs are in there yeah we all know all about that stuff anyway that's all pretty straightforward no different to your TV your hi-fi we've been doing all that swag so yeah in the box there she is like oh she's looking pretty she's looking pretty i'm gonna be uh itching to find somewhere to actually put this little baby let's um grab that oh he's nice and light oh yeah i'm liking it she's sweet let's just put him down there a second we'll just move this box out of the way and then um Yeah, so there he is. We'll just uh, pull off that plastic. Pull off the plastic bag. Get that on. Oh, there she is. Oh, she's looking nice. Feels good, you know? Feels good. Looks good. Oh, a bit of rubbery on the outside around the edges. A bit rubbery on the outside there. Look, looks. Oh, and there's your handles. All right, let's get these handles up. Yeah, that's sweet. That's sweet. She is nice. She is nice. So literally what I'm going to do with this machine, lad, so we're going to kind of do... Oh, I can see a Mo Hotel <laughs> on there. Now, um, yeah, so yeah, I need to get a Mo Hotel sticker on this as well. But um, yeah, so what we're going to do is do an ongoing test with it. We're going to get it um, charged up. And I don't know. Oh, power. Let's hit the button. There you go. Wow. She's on. Look at this. 80%. 80% on the display already. Yeah, this is going to be like an ongoing. What we're going to do is tell you how we're getting along with it on the way. And uh, yeah, just see how things develop with it, really. So uh, I'm just going to get my phone charging lead. Yeah, so there we have the display on now, and I'm just going to plug in my smartphone. So there's my little USB plug, and I'm going to plug that into the unit like that. And then I think it's on the D it's a DC, so press the DC button. Oh, you got to hold this for two seconds, apparently. There we go. Oh, and he's charging. Amazing. There we go. Just showing on the little display there. Oh, he's targeting. Yeah, that's amazing. That's good. Lovely. That is super cool. Yeah, so basically, yeah, we're just going to um, see how this little baby performs over our trips and stuff. And uh, yeah, what can you say? Wireless charging on the top lot. Just checking out the rear end of it now, and there's the input for your 
charging connections so that's that one there and on the back of this unit it's got this little light so you press this but oh it's got a super bright light on it oh and a flashing light as well look wow that's pretty nice i like it that is nice again yeah another use you know for me there straight away you've always got a, a brilliant backup light in your motorhome if anything goes um could put in your motorhome that you haven't got any electric or anything that's going to be super handy although like we could have done with them the weekend we have got a, a really powerful torch that uh, i do normally take with me on dark nights so uh, yeah that's all cool anyway yeah lovely yeah still just having a little play with our uh, total power a little power pack and i've just what i've just done actually i've just plugged it into the 240 volt socket down the bottom there into our little Avetech TV in the front of our motor. Yeah, she's all powered up. Ideal. Yeah, so that's looking pretty darn cool. Excellent. Yeah, brilliant. So we're pretty happy with that. You know, I think it's one of them things, like we were saying before about um, if you've got like a small camper van or something like that and you, you want to just take some power with you, um, it's just going to be so invaluable for that. I've just got so many um, things that uh, I, I keep thinking about, you know, even my little Bluetooth speaker, stuff like that. If you want to like run your little Bluetooth speaker um, and, and, you know, little things, run some lights outside or something, you can just like put the power wherever you want it, you know, some like, some little fairy lights outside, some uh, bits and bobs like that, it'd be just uh, so cool. So uh, I think it's just going to be one of them things that, um, yeah, we're just going to keep it charged up, keep trying to keep it, every time we uh, get a source uh, to charge it up and when we're on the move, charge up, and then uh, we'll just see how things pan out with it, you know, and uh, we'll just keep you informed and uh, see how things go along. But um, I'm, I'm definitely uh, looking forward to running this little baby. And like I say, again, it's just that fridge thing that we want to uh, um, look after as well. And uh, it's just going to be so good. Yeah, we can take it wherever you want. And it's not that heavy to uh, transport if you want to. Uh, and me, you know what I've been like with my MacBook. I need power for my MacBook. So uh, I'm going to be really super interested to see how it powers up my MacBook and recharges my MacBook. If it does that little baby, I'm going to be a happy bunny because uh, basically I was trying to get a... Um, uh, well, you can't, you cannot um, get a, uh, a, a USB lead for a MacBook. So it, it needs um, power. And, what, you know, I'm hoping that all this is going to do the job. So I haven't worked out. Well, let me know. Anybody that's using one of these powering their MacBook, let me know in the uh, comments. And, um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Thanks a lot, guys, for watching the video. And uh, thanks again for Susie. And like I say, the um, number of contact details tagged in at the end, uh, tagged in the description. Thank you very much. Cheers. Bye.